Yo everybody, what's up and welcome back to Phil and D's Travel Spree. It is day three of our anniversary trip here in Cancun at the Rio Tequila Resort. For those of y'all that have been following along, you know that breakfast has been a real struggle for us. We have not made it to the actual breakfast yet. We've just been, we just been eating the leftovers. Um, breakfast ends at about 10.30. And so right now it's actually almost 10 o'clock. So we in a rush, cause like I said, we, don't, we didn't set any alarm clocks or anything like that. So these are actually still getting ready right now. Um, we, but we, we determined to go make this breakfast. But after that, make sure you stay tuned because there is lots of this resort you haven't seen yet. I'm um, gonna take you to the beach with us, the main pool, so getting some activities here on the resort as well. And then also, we may actually hit up the nightclub. So make sure you stay tuned, make sure you hit that subscribe button because we got an excited day planned for you. See you later. What's up y'all, we made it back to the room, got a quick change of wardrobe, but let's talk about that breakfast first. Like we finally got a chance to make it to breakfast and when you go in there, it's like, like how do we keep missing this? Like, cause you were asleep. But I know, but like, we shouldn't have. But I'm tired. I'm still tired this morning. Like, so look, so the last two days between the other ball, they only give us like eggs, some burnt sausage and some bacon. Like in there, like you had everything that you could ever ask for. Like I even made me an avocado toast. I ain't never had avocado toast in my life. But uh, I mean, like they, it, it was you bougie. Huh? Bougie on the resort. I'm not bougie. But you could try new things, new experiences when you, you know. But anyways, <laughs> y'all, the breakfast was good, and and they still in there serving. If you want coffee, they'll bring you drinks. They'll bring you all kind of stuff. So it's still a buffet, but you also still get that good quality treatment. So anyways, uh, you see, we changed clothes, so now we're getting ready to actually head to the main pool. Sounds like they got some music and stuff going out there. Get us a few drinks in. We're gonna hang out there, and then we'll probably make it over to the beach. So make sure y'all come along with us.
How you enjoying yourself? Jesus, be a breeze, baby. It's a little hot. <laughs> Long in the pool. Get back in the pool. It'll cool you. It'll cool you down. It's nasty. I feel nasty. I told you, shit, like a cat around water. The tooth can't exist. Unless she in the shower. I was in there, and then it was like. Unless she in the shower, that's the only way she do water. Oh, excuse the, the paper towels on my neck. <laughs> I ain't <laughs> even. <laughs> Wait, did Dabby, Dabby sweat off a little bit? Yeah, my neck sweat. Helping lose the double chin, I guess. Double chin. But you look good. Don't you look good, y'all? Say, do you look good? Put down the comment. Do you look good? Or well, you can tell the truth. Say, do you look hot? Like hot. Yes, yeah, she hot. I'm I dead hot. Like H O double T. Hot. No. Like burning <laughs> up. Like you need to be in some AC. Uh, it's okay though. Don't yeah. make it work. We got the beach next. They ain't seen the beach. Pray for me. She gonna be all right. Your boy gonna take care of her. She's been in the pool the whole time making friends. I've been up here sweating. That's her fault though. She could have been in the pool making the friends pool. with me. Hey, shout out to uh, James and Morgan. I'm gonna put their picture right here. James and Morgan from the UK. Hey man, shout out to our real good people. They from the north part of London. But I will say I this. I would have met you. But I will say this. Like, this resort, has had a lot of people from the UK. A lot. I honestly think it's, what you think, more people from the UK that are here than Americans. Like, everywhere you go, you see people accent. Champagne Fontaine! What's up, baby? <laughs> It's been a lot of people from the UK. It's been a lot of people from Mexico. The Americans, the Americans, we are outnumbered. We are outnumbered. People, people are making that trip across the pond. And I feel like maybe we need to return the favor. Maybe we'll do a Mediterranean cruise. Okay, no, no, no. I thought you were talking about flying. <laughs> we got to fly. Flying. We got to fly to get to the Mediterranean now. Can we fly to a resort? We flew here? In the UK? Mediterranean all inclusive? Yeah. Who knows? Who knows? Champagne Fontaine. Hey, Champagne Fontaine been holding it down, man. Hey, he been holding us down this whole trip, man. Thank you, man. I really appreciate you. <laughs> all righty. <laughs> Thank you, man. Yeah, we. I'm good, man. Thank you. But who knows? Mediterranean all-inclusive. It's a 10-hour plane ride now. Good with that? Hey, make sure you stay tuned to feeling these travels bring. It's a 10-hour plane ride. Uh, look, all I do on the plane is sleep. He's talking real hot stuff on this camera. When that camera turn off, I can't do it. <laughs> Dang, do it. really? Yeah. Really? You gonna yeah. put me out there like that? Yeah. Hold you accountable. Look, so y'all know next year anniversary is gonna be a cruise. So, however, I kind of think that's not fair now because we do all these cruises throughout the year. So I feel like each anniversary should be a little No, we said when we got married, we're gonna alternate. We, weren't doing all these we said cruises we was gonna alternate. Don't do that. We weren't doing all these cruises. Next year now. is the cruise. If we did random resorts, like June year, 2024, <laughs> we'll be on the cruise. And June 2025. Mediterranean? If y'all want to see us go to the Mediterranean, put Mediterranean down in the comment section. But in the meantime, I'm gonna keep sipping. <laughs> y'all, this is the devil. El Diablo, right here. El Diablo, 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 him. Oh, no, man. One, two, three. All right, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, y'all? So, Hi. as y'all been seeing, we've been having an event fulfilled day at the pool. Some of us more than oh, others. Was very <laughs> I'm trying to play so, we are actually getting ready to head to the beach. So, uh, this property, 
Well, if you're familiar with Ryu properties, you know you can kind of bounce around to some of the other Ryu properties. So there's there's a bunch of other Ryu properties here in the vicinity. And so um, this one doesn't actually have a beach, but the next, the one across the street does have a beach. So we're getting ready to head that way. Um, they said it's about a 10 minute walk, uh, but if you don't want to walk, they do have a tram system available that will take you to the beach. Um, they, they said it runs every 10 minutes, so it's not that much of a wait. Um, so we're getting ready to head that way and see what the beach looks like. And of course, you know, we're going to take you along. So make sure you stay tuned. take us long to get here at all the only thing about the shuttle is it doesn't run between the hours of one and three o'clock um, so if you want to take the shuttle just keep that in mind but other than that like I said it's every 10 minutes I believe until six o'clock so not a bad deal two minute ride or a 10 minute walk so first impressions this beach is nice the water is beautiful the sand is soft they got plenty for you to eat here you know what I'm saying like the only thing is they don't have umbrellas out here but they do have plenty of palm trees. Um, so, they got quite a few palm trees. You just got to shield you. You just got to find the right spot at the right time, depending on where the sun is in the day. But bring a big hat. <laughs> bring a big hat. But other than that, the water is beautiful. Like everybody is, everybody is nice. They they do offer, um, you know, some water sports and like um, jet skis and parasailing and things like that. As soon as you get out here. So when you get here, there may be a couple of people that ask you, but other than that, I mean, they won't keep pounding if you if you tell them no. Um, but man, we should have been out here day one, day one. But I believe this beach. I think we came at the right time on the relaxing day. Yeah, I mean, that's kind of been the vibe for today, real chill day. Uh, but I believe this beach belongs to Rio Yucatan. And I'm like, so, like I said, it is part of one of the Ryu resorts, like I said. So, you do have access not only to the beach, but you can also go eat lunch and participate in some of the other events on the other Ryu properties while you're here. So, that's one thing we really love about Ryu. Ryu is one of our favorite, you know, companies. So, that's... Don't forget your username for the Wi-Fi. Yeah. So so, to, yeah. Uh, sign in when you come. Yeah. So, we don't remember the username. They gave that to us when we checked in, but... Yeah, you do have to re-sign once you come to, you know, some of the other properties. Oh, look at your girl with the back out. You better cut up. <laughs> you not gonna pay me no mind? No? <laughs> Alright, y'all. Look, I'm gonna need y'all to say a serious prayer for my girl, D. My baby, she has a serious water phobia. And she will not go past the water to where the water level is at her knees she will literally stop i tried to invite her out with me go on my back she will not pass that line so i'm gonna show y'all where she's standing at so she says she trusts me but she won't go she won't go any further any further so she says she want to do take a couple pictures and that's it look at her y'all Look at her. She will not go any further than that. Look, water is below the knees, right at the knees. And she's stuck. Right, She has not moved past that point the last 15 minutes. She's been standing right there. Hi. I'm in the water. Barely. I'm in the water. <laughs> Girl, what were you only getting your ankles wet? That's more than ankles. You felt that. Okay, a little knee. You come to the waist. Oh, sweet waist. Get on, just get on my back. I got you. I will take care of you. I, I ain't gonna let nothing happen to you. I believe you. So you believe me? So come on. No. Come on. No. Come on. That's not even your back. Right? <laughs> <laughs> not funny. So we. Oh, we. 
stand right here. No, you go. Where you going? Right here. Right here. I was thinking for you. So part of this resort, they do also include lunch and dinner over here at the beach. So that's usually where they serve the lunch and the dinners over there back there. And then they also have, you know, plenty of seating for you to enjoy some good scenery. Um, right now they are actually closed. They are actually getting ready to prepare for dinner, which starts at 6.30. So uh, we missed lunch. I mean, it's not a problem. We ate pretty good, you know, across the street. Um, but, you know, we are going to try to do another specialty dining tonight at dinner. Um, so we won't be here for too much longer, but we are going to head back to the resort, to shower up, freshen up, and get ready for dinner. But in the meantime, we're going to enjoy some more of this beach. So like I said earlier, that beach is shared with the other Ryu properties. And this is another Ryu resort that we also do have access to. As long as you have this red wristband right here that says Ryu, or says the Ryu Tequila, like I said, you have access to, I believe it's like two or three other resorts. Hello. How you doing? <laughs> Had a nice relaxing little swim at the beach. Don't swim. look at me like that. Swim. Don't look at me like that. Let's swim. Do not question my vernacular. <laughs> nice little swim at the beach. Had to get the sand up off me because I was in that thing, y'all. How we get the sand up off me? Uh, cause I went deeper. I was in the shallow end swimming. But anywho. Yo, we was in angle deep water and I had to splash the sand up off of her. So I'm literally scooping the water up. You know, up. <laughs> it's a shame when your man will not let you live. I, I helped like, you out. I helped get, on. I helped clean you up. Come on. I was just living my best life and he was going to go shoot it down. Anywho. Nice little swim at the beach. Um, it was really cool and relaxing. The sun wasn't beaming. Everything I needed right then and there. Yeah, so. But they do have showers uh, outside the beach. So we're going to go ahead to the showers to get the rest of the sand off. So we can head back. We're going to head back to the room, get dressed. Cause we are going to try another specialty dining tonight. They got steak, Asian, Mexican, and what? Italian. Italian. Y'all get on him in the comments. Tell him to let D live. Let D live. Let or, D live. Or should D, or D, should D live. start to live? D, this is my definition of living. Just because your definition and my definition are not the same, don't mean that I am not living la vida loca. Yeah, you do look real crazy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. Let D live now. Um, got the sand off of our toes and everywhere else it was stuck at. Um, <laughs> it was a lot of places. <laughs> <laughs> it was a lot of sand. Okay. Um, so now we're about to go try this Italian restaurant. Hopefully, you know, the line isn't too long. The Mexican restaurant is across the way. Yeah, back at the, the beach club we were at earlier at the beach. So we said... We're gonna, gonna find some over here. Yeah, we don't feel like making it back that way, so we're gonna find something here on this campus. So, so we're gonna see how the Italian is. Fingers crossed that it's good, but you know, if it's not, we always got the main buffet. <laughs> <laughs> see you there. So, not getting dinner as soon as I thought. Apparently, they have a dress code, so they kicked me out. So, one of the one of the uh, servers that was in the uh, the Asian restaurant yesterday, he greeted us. He was cool about it, but he said I had to have on a different shirt. So it was really not that big of a problem. I understand it's specialty dining and there are certain standards that they have to uphold. So going back by myself, cause D, she left me hanging y'all. She went, she said, I'm gonna go to the bar. I'm gonna let you go all the way back. So, so I'm gonna head back to the room, change my shirt real quick, and then I'll meet up with D later. We in y'all. We in. <laughs> Hi. We're finally made it. I told him, I say, look, if this show if this shirt don't work, we going to the buffet. <laughs> Forget the steak restaurant. We wouldn't even gonna try. We just needed sleeves, that's all. Um but while I waited, I had to revamp a whole drink. I had sex on the beach, but it was too syrupy and like nasty. Hello. Hi. What's up, man? Please, yes. Yeah. I've been sweating, running back to the room for another shirt. <laughs> Not 
Can I have a beer? Yeah. Yeah. And so I had to drink a little bit down and I had to put some champagne on top because, you know, I'm a bartender at heart, but not really, though. And it was so good. So good. Okay. Well... I know now. Now know who to ask to fix me a drink at the house now. Me and my martini. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Just like the Asian restaurant, they do have um, a buffet option. They also do have a la carte option only. Um, they do give you a little QR code so you can scan and look at the menu. And I'm actually trying the lasagna today. So this is what it looks like. Looks good, they make it real nice, decorate the plate. So keep in mind that the a la carte entrees are exclusively only for the specialty restaurant. So these options are not available anywhere else at the resort. So I'm about to cut into it, let's give it a try. <laughs> Bro. The best thing I've had on this resort the entire time we've been here, by far. By far. Tell the devil's on you. Oh. Good. Oh. There you go. We were sitting here talking. <laughs> We were sitting there talking, and I was telling D, like, this gonna feel like the last night. And you I know? said, because they ain't singing to us and telling us to get off the shoe. Yeah, they ain't, it's show time, <laughs> you know? They start saying, all oh, your bags are packed, it's time to go, you know what I'm saying? Like, what just, it do to you, you what know? it do to you? On the ship? Yeah, when oh, they start man, singing that song. You be all in the fields, man. <laughs> Oh man, I can't believe. <laughs> <laughs> but now it's like, all right, oh, this your last day? All right, see you later. Like, like that, you know what I'm saying? So. Well, that's because everybody got different last days here. Yeah. So. But so, I feel valued on the cruise ship. All right. They don't want me to leave. And cut. <laughs> Interested. Real interested. Yo, so sadly we have reached the conclusion of this vlog series. We had a lot of fun on this trip. We made some new memories. We ate a lot. We drank a lot. Overall, it was just such an amazing experience. However, Jumanji done came out on his last day. <laughs> Tell him what happened. And when we were leaving dinner, a bat tried to attack me. Okay, maybe not attack me. It was a little <laughs> exaggerated. But, like, it was flying around. I was like, is that a bat? And so I started singing Into the Unknown. And then it came, like, right here. And it like, kept going. <laughs> and I was like, <laughs> And I know everybody's looking at me crazy. But that's okay, though, because I was trying to protect myself from the bat. No, she screamed, like, loud. Yes. <laughs> It was scary. Maybe they want you singing then. Apparently, I stopped singing. That's for sure. <laughs> the staff have been great and awesome. I've been able to use a little bit of my Espanol. Um, the people that we've been on the excursions with have been great. Yeah. We've met a lot of new friends, a lot of friends from the UK. 
a lot of friends that found us and just kind of stuck with us. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, so it's been an experience. Um, I did kind of want to get out the resort and kind of walk. Cause they have like little shops along, but your girl is tired, so that ain't happening. Maybe next time. <laughs> next time we'll do a little walking. But overall, it's been a good time, even though I've been talked about. I got in some water and I played D style. I enjoyed myself the way I needed to. It was great. So if you made it to the end of this video, we definitely appreciate you watching. Go ahead and hit that like button. Leave a comment if you want to. And if you haven't already, if you're not a part of the family, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so that you'll be notified every time we drop some new content. And you'll be a part of the Spreezy family. So until the next vlog series, see y'all later. We out.